And all my friends from the AT40 archives, a few years ago, American Top 40 had the chance to talk to the man at number 21, Michael Jackson. It was on his 21st birthday. That day, he and his brothers told us how they got their start in music. This is like looking through the Jackson family scrapbook. Listen to this. We used to travel in the van, go to New York, do the Apollo 7 shows a night, go to the Regal Theater, go to the Uptown, the Kansas City, St. Louis, and the VW band with all our equipment. The five of us and the, and the drummer and the keyboard player. This was in 1966. And we would do like six shows a night with Jackie Wilson, James Brown, The Miracles, The OJs, Guys Night and the Pips. And see, we would come on amateur hour. See, these, these people were, you know, they had like a local record going. So we would come on amateur hour. We would win the, the trophy every time. And... Um, then we did the Rego and this, this guy named Bobby Taylor and Gladys Knight told Motown about us. So we decided to do a little audition. We auditioned for Barry Gordy in Detroit. And here we are singing and all the Motown stars were there. Diana Ross, Temptations, Smokey Robinson. And we, we're singing and all these people are watching us. And we did our whole show and they loved it. They really raved over it. And Diana Ross came over to us and she said especially... I loved what I saw, and she said she wanted to take special interest in our career. And Motown moved us out to California. Half of the group stayed with Barry Gordy. Half of the group stayed with Diana Ross. And we recorded and recorded. And, and, and ate out of her refrigerator. <laughs> <and stuff laughs> her ate up all her food. <laughs> what really made me know that we were kind of good was when, I mean, you'd be up there dancing, and all these quarters and dollars would be thrown at you, and you're doing splits and picking up money and putting it in your pocket. I mean, our pockets were so loaded with money that we, we couldn't keep them up. I mean, we'd be loaded with money. We used to sell our pictures. <laughs> yeah, we didn't really have no. We'd go in the audience selling pictures. <laughs> then we think today who would want those pictures? <laughs>